again, I decided to do my empties. I have accumulated a lot of things, and I just want to share with you, with you all, what I thought of the things that I have, um, of these things that I've finished. Um, I have quite a few, so I'm going to go ahead and get started. Now, for um, hair, I have been using this Derm Organic um, shampoo, conditioner, hair mask. I have been enjoying this, so I just, excuse me, I just wanted to show you all just one bottle that I finished. Um, you can get this stuff at Ulta. You can also get it at um, Marshall's TJ Maxx. I've seen it, so I really do like this stuff. Um, another hair item that I finished up is the Carol's Daughters Hair Balm, and I really like it. I will definitely purchase that again if um, I can find it, but I did get this. I believe I got it from either um, Ulta or um, Target. Yeah, so Ulta or Target. But that's the hair bomb. I really liked it. I actually put it on my hair before I go to bed and um, wrapped my hair and it, it moisturized it. Oh, it. It did an awesome job. So I really did like that stuff. Um, now, was that all the hair stuff? Yeah. Now, for um, my face and makeup remover and stuff, um, the All May, uh, if I can say it, it's the All May um, eye makeup remover. And I got the moisturizing um, formula, but I really didn't like it. It, it made my eyes burn a bit, so I really, um, I can't suge suggest this, um, this actual product. Um, but I did try to finish it. I used it with some other makeup removers and I was able to finish the bottle. Um, the next thing is the Clarisonic Face Cleanser and it's actually the Refreshing Gel Cleanser. Came with my Clarisonic and I finally got to finish it. So I'm happy about that. Uh, let's see. Is there any more face stuff? Oh, yeah. Um, my Neutrogena Visibly Even Lotion. Now this is um, what I would use in the morning. So I actually finished it all up, and um, I used the face wash as well. So I really, I really do enjoy this, and I'll definitely buy it again. So it's like my staple. Um, another thing, a few face, uh, not face care, but like foundation stuff and concealer. Foundation, concealer, um, things like that that I've used up, and I've, I've, you know, have mixed feelings on a couple of these. Um, now, for one, the Maybelline Instant Angel one won't get again. The twisty thing broke. Um, sponge would just like explode with foundation at any moment, so I really didn't like that. Um, I did enjoy the L'Oreal True Match um, little pencil concealer concealer. Um, I really did enjoy that. And the NYX or the NYX um, HD concealer um, wasn't my favorite. So I think you'll probably just stick to probably the Bare Minerals liquid, um, the eye brightening concealer. So this, I finished that one. Um, also, I got two of the Colorstay foundations and I finally finished them. Um, and I got the 400 Caramel. I got one with SPF and one without. So that's why I have two different ones. But that's my color um, was Caramel. I've had it for quite some time. So I'm happy I finally finished the foundations. Um, finally finished, you know, talking about finally finished, this um, uh, Tarte Maracuja Creaseless um, Concealer. I think that they've changed their packaging now. But, um, you know, how you get one of these and it can last you, like, years, basically. So, I really do. Um, I do like this. So, I definitely have another one. And I'm going to be continuing to use that. Um, oh, okay. And then I have these two eye creams that I finished up. Um, one from Tarte, the C Eye Brightener. And then the Ultimate Lift Eye Gel. I can't really suggest that you go out and get either one of these. Um, they basically, I didn't see anything. You know what I'm saying? I try to use eye cream as much as I can at night, but I really didn't notice any big difference. So um, I'd say like the Tarte, I would go with that one just because it's more natural. Um, and then I also um, got, well, I, I used up this um, lip rescue from desert essence which is an organic brand 
So I really, I like that and I have a couple more. Now next, I, I, didn't, I didn't enjoy this um, eyelash glue. It didn't work for me. I got the, um, I got the one that's la latex free, the latex free formula and it's clear. And you know, it just made my eyelash fall off. I don't wear eyelashes that much, but when I do, and I use this, it doesn't work. But the Revlon works good, and I'm still working on that one. Um, the Revlon eye, eyelash glue. Um, this body face and hair oil. Now that's really good stuff. I really do like that. And um, it smells amazing. So I used it just on my body. It, it has a really fresh scent. Okay, my last two things that I finished up that are completely empty. Um, I've got this Derma E. And this is a faith cream for age spots. Not the best thing is on sale at Ulta. I wouldn't get it again. If I'm going to try to, you know, clear up some uh, scars, some dark spots, I use cocoa butter. Um, and then this um, Bath and Body Works Eucalyptus Tea Sugar Scrub um, was amazing. So I would definitely get that again if, you know, they had it sell. It's kind of pricey. But, um... I enjoyed that a lot and guys that's my empties and I hope you all enjoyed that if you did please thumbs up um, comment subscribe let me know what you've been finishing up and I appreciate you all watching thanks bye